Hello everybody, Craig here from the Open Pandora project. Now, as lots of you know, occasionally from time to time I write iPhone or other software and that is to fund our little open source ventures like the Pandora or the iControl pad. And what I want to show you is my latest offering, which is Dizzy Wizards. We wanted to call it Bloody Wizards, but that broke the rules of the iStore. Anyway, it's sort of like a cross between worms and lemmings and I'm going to show you a couple of levels from the game, um, just so you can get a taste of it, and then maybe if you're feeling generous, you can pop over to the ice store and buy the full game. And of course, um, it helps fund our inventions and escapades. I'll just show you a little level on it. Um, the idea is you've got these objects down here and you can place them down on the map. And then using those, you get the wizard. Oh God! Oh God, you've been destroyed! There's blood and everything. That must have just been a fluke. Let's not play that level again. Um, that was horrible. Um, ah, this looks like a more reasonable level. So anyway, as I was saying, the idea is that you can use these little tools to do things like this one cuts through the floor, look. So you put these down and then you have to get them down to the exit, which is down here. Opening doors and things as- OH GOD THEY'RE BEING BLENDED IN A BLENDER! That, THAT'S HORRIBLE! Oh no no no! No let's quit this! Let's quit this! Um... Oh god... OH WHAT'S HAPPENING NOW?! OH GOD THEY'RE ALL EXPLODING! Oh... D this sort of thing should be banned! It shouldn't be allowed at all! So yes, you can use objects, for example, to put them down and block their path and things. And... Oh God, their heads have been cut off! They, what, this is a horrible game. I, I don't think that I don't think that this game should be available. 